it's Ruby and today I'm going to be showing you an updated school morning routine which has been very highly requested. So I typically wake up at around 6.15 and then I will read for around 15 minutes but it might be around half an hour, it really does depend on how absorbed I am in my book. then I will head to my wardrobe to pick out my outfit for the day and I am in sixth form so I wear a suit every day but I get complete free reign over the shirt that I wear and today I decided to wear this red one from Abercrombie Kids and then of course I make my bed which I always do every morning sometimes I decide to iron the bed sheets with my travel iron but this morning I didn't because I don't know I just didn't feel like doing it this morning and then I will also fold up my pyjamas and these are a really nice new pair which I got from Next. Then I will go over to open my curtains and let some daylight in and also open my window because it can get quite stuffy when the heating is on overnight which usually it isn't but some mornings it is. I really love the smell of autumn mornings and winter mornings. Then I decided to light my pumpkin which is left over from Halloween and I actually carved a button so it would be like Coraline. Then I head to the bathroom and since I'm usually the first one up, I will open up the shutters to let some light in here as well. And this morning I am using this matcha soap from the Matcha Reserve to wash my hands. The Matcha Reserve were really kind in sending me the soap and I love it and it smells incredible, like really fresh. And I also decided to wash my face with this soap. I don't usually wash my face, actually with soap that is, um, but recently since they sent me this I have been using it and I honestly do love it. It makes me feel really refreshed in the mornings. Um, so then I will brush my teeth as well, which is really important, and also use some mouthwash. And then of course I will do my contact lenses. Because I, as I've said before, sight is really rather important. So then I will go and do my hair, and I actually use this chair from my Kit Kittridge American School desk to um, prop over my mirror because otherwise it just closes. So I like to take one small piece of hair and plait it, and then feed this into a ponytail. This is pretty much how I've been wearing my, my hair every day to school recently. And um, since it's getting quite cold, I've noticed that my skin is getting really dry, so I've started wearing moisturizer in the morning and also putting on lip scrub and Carmex lip balm. And then I will straighten my fringe so that it's neater, which is again something I've recently started doing. Yes, that's the remnants of a pumpkin. Um, I'm not ashamed to say it, it does look rather messy and actually now it's been taken down. So I'm making some tea at the moment and I'm using my Marauders Map mug which is rather cool, it's a heat changing mug. So again from the match reserve I was sent some vanilla matcha tea and this is at the moment my favourite tea and I'm not just saying that, um, I promise you that this video is not sponsored, all opinions expressed are my own. But this tea is just gorgeous. It tastes really Christmassy, but also a bit like wheatgrass, so rather fresh. And they also sent me this bamboo stirrer so that I could properly mix the tea, which is something that I've never really done before, um, but it works really effectively. And all links for the match reserve will be down below. So then I decided to make myself some toast for breakfast. At the moment, toast with peanut butter and pumpkin has been my favourite breakfast. It's just so autumnal and I like to dust it off with a little nutmeg and cinnamon. And I also read at the breakfast table, which is an essential. Then I will proceed to wash up my plate and everything that I used. And then I head into the snug and I light the gas fire so that it's really cosy and I get into the autumn spirit really. So this month I'm using my Life in Diagrams book for November 
and so I'm just filling in my uh, sleep log, my breakfast log and my five a day tracker from the day before. And then I sit down to read and I probably do this for about half an hour before, uh, whilst I finish my tea and then I will go outside for a little stroll in the garden because I love autumn and winter mornings and I think it's really important to get some fresh air. So I'm putting on my new Bowdoin coat. This is a military style one and I recently got it and I have quickly fallen in love with it. I will leave a link to it in the description box because I'm sure you'd love it as much as I do. And it was such a gorgeous morning this morning. It was rather misty and the autumn leaves crunched joyously underfoot. I decided to go down the bottom of the garden to the vegetable patches. This is my mum's rather neat one and mine is a very messy pumpkin patch. I decided to grow pumpkins this year and a few of them aren't, weren't actually ripe for Halloween but I was just checking up on those that were remaining and as you can see they're still rather green. When I get back inside I will write a to-do list for school, so if I've got any meetings or assemblies or anything that I need to remember. And sometimes I will write a letter, do some homework if I did do all of it the night before, or I might continue reading, it really does depend on my mood. And I will just take my school bag and head out the door to school. Thank you so much for watching this video, I hope that you enjoyed and have a productive week.